Hi Blair, um, I just wanted to do a video response to your Juicy Jabber, um, the questions you had about like your iTunes and your Dear, the Dear John book and like stuff like that. Um, oh, the first thing is like I'm a really big fan of your videos, I really like watching them. I'm actually wearing one of your makeup looks right now, if you can see I'm actually wearing the um, I think it was called like inexpensive way to create a MAC neutral. Yeah, I don't know. My my makeup's over there, but I actually like went to Walgreens and they had that sunset strip by Physicians Formula for like four dollars. So I picked it up and I was like, wow, that's really cool. I can like do one of her tutorials. But anyway, I wear that look a lot. I really like it. Um, <laughs> um, okay. So the first thing, your iTunes. All right, I own a desktop and I own a laptop and I also have an iPod Touch. Um. I'm not an AT&T customer, but that's why I don't have the iPhone. Um, I first had my laptop, and I had iTunes on my laptop, and I plugged in my iPod Touch. Everything was fine. Put the music through like that little white USB cord, um, and my iTunes were on this. And then I don't really use that laptop anymore because I purchased a desktop, um, and now I hooked for like the first time. I hooked my iPod into my desktop to my iTunes. And it was the same account under my same email name. And all the music I had on that iTunes on my laptop was erased. And the music I had on the desktop iTunes was synced on. And it deleted anything else that was on it. It only had the iTunes from my desktop library. If that makes any sense. Um, I just really wouldn't recommend it. That's my input and my past experience with like iTunes and um like using other computers and trying to like add libraries from different libraries i think the best thing you can do is like get a separate account and if you get a separate account you can use that account for those itunes and the other account for the other itunes making two accounts one on your laptop and one on your desktop if that makes sense i don't know i also went to my boyfriend's once because he had music i wanted to put on my ipod and i was like can i sync my my iPod touch onto your laptop he's like no if you do that you know it'll delete it again and that would have been in his name so I really don't know I think it's like a little quirk that Apple should look into fixing or at least look into making easier to add music from iTunes libraries maybe I'm all wrong but that is my best experience with it oh and for like music I don't know if you've ever tried Rhapsody but I used to subscribe to Rhapsody. Rhapsody is really cool. There is like a monthly fee. It's like between $13 to $15 you pay a month. But it's like unlimited downloads. And um, I don't know. It's really great. I probably spend like $9 on an album a month at least anyways. So with Rhapsody it's just, it's, it's a really good service. Um, next question you had. Oh, like your armoire? I watched your room tour, the video you had your room tour. I think your room is like really, really awesome. Um, I have a TV in my room as well. It's like right back there. I don't know if this video can catch it. Um, but I have a TV and I personally think your armoire is really, really great. I think it's a really great addition to your room. By the way, like it's gorgeous. And, I don't know, it sort of reminds me of how, like, hotel rooms are set up. Like, you have the bed, and then you have the armoire where you can, like, lay in bed and watch TV. I think that's really cool. I would keep your desk and your armoire separate. And also, I don't know if you have one or not, but, like, a gaming system. Like, I have a Wii hooked up to my TV, and I can't hook my Wii up to my computer. I mean, first off, my computer is not 27 inches. That's so cool. Mine's only like 17, so I wouldn't use it as a TV. But I totally understand what you mean about watching shows like online. Because I do the whole, you know, go to abc.com and stream the free episodes. I do that a lot. But, um, I don't know. I just think your armor is really cool. Like, what if you have friends over? You can all watch a movie or something. It's just a better feel of gathering around a TV than a computer screen, I think. I don't know. This is my opinion. Um, what else did you have on your video? Oh, um, Dear John, yeah, I love this book. I actually didn't know there was a movie coming out about it until you posted it on your vlog. And then I watched the trailer, and I just think it's going to be really, really, really great. I cried 
I'm reading it again, but I cried at like the fifth chapter, and I, I almost wanted to stop the first time I read it, because I was like, oh my gosh, this is too sad, like, I love happy love stories, and when two people can be together, <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know, I love this book, and it's really cool that, like, you like it too, and that's cool, um, so yeah, I guess that's all, I don't really remember anything else. But those are just my opinions and my little answers. I don't know if they're right or wrong, but, you know, that's my input. Okay, <laughs> see ya.